electron configuration of Al3 plus aluminum ion. So, to write the electron configuration of aluminum 3 plus ion, we need to write the electron configuration of neutral aluminum. You know that the atomic number of aluminum is 13. So, you need to write the electron configuration of this neutral aluminum atom. You know that we usually distribute electrons to different sublevel sp, d, and f, right? So, this is our first sublevel, second, third, and fourth. S can handle maximum 2, P can handle maximum 6, D can 10, and F can 14. So, we need to memorize this sublevel sequence in case of writing electron configuration. So, consider this S and write it twice. SS. Then, consider this PS as a whole unit and write, you have to write like this, PS, right? PS, PS, twice, twice. And then you, you need to consider these three sub-level together and write it twice, DPS, DPS, then DPS. Then you need to consider these five sub level together FDPS FDPS and also you can write FDPS many times. So say with me SS, PSPS, DPS, DPS. FDPS, FDPS, FDPS. That is no limit for writing FDPS. The write the number of uh, writing will uh, the number of writing FDPS will depend on the atomic number, right? So, however, let me help you to memorize this sequence in another form. Say with me: school, school, public school, public school daily public school daily public school then fu fully daily public school fully daily public school 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 public school public school daily public school daily public school then fully daily public school fully daily public school or you can uh, you actually you don't need to memorize you, if you can uh, draw a picture like this xpdf then you have to consider like this so we have in neutral uh, aluminum uh, element we have 13 electrons atomic number 13 mean, means it has 13 electrons 13 proton and 13 electrons that is 13 uh, positive charge will be neutralized by 13 negative charge so 2 4 then 6 2 4 6 10 here 2 12 and then here 1 this is 13 right so we don't need this subcell since we have covered everything Look, this is the electron configuration of aluminum. Now you have to number this sp orbital, right? sp subshell, sp tf. S start from 1, p2, d3, and f4. So start this 1s, s, s start from 1s then 2s, then 3s, and p start from 2, 2p, this will be 3p, right? Now, we'll, this is the electron configuration of neutral aluminum. Now, we'll write the electron configuration of this ion. So, you know that the atomic number of aluminum is fixed, so it has 
13 proton right 13 proton but how many electrons for 3 plus you need to uh, deduct 3 from this uh, 13 so you have 10 electrons so 10 electrons will neutralize 10 protons and more 3 protons will appear here as 3 plus so we need to remove three electrons from this neutral aluminum electron configuration so how to do that so at first we have to uh, remove electron from the highest value of n subshell then we need to consider if necessary l highest value of n plus l so here the highest value of n equal to 3 here 3 so we'll now apply the next step we'll consider highest value of n plus l you know that l zero means s subshell one means p subshell two means d subshell and and three means f subshell so three plus zero that is zero n plus value of three s is zero then for three p n plus value is 4 so highest value is 4 so we need to remove 3 electrons so one electron will go from here right and two more electron will go from this right it's n plus l value is 3 plus 0 that is 3 so from here right from here so this is the So this is the electron configuration of aluminum 3 plus. We have 6, 8, 10 electrons. So let us show me the another way to write the electron configuration of this aluminum and aluminum 3 plus. So that is why we need to We need to look at this diagram. Look, yes, here we have four room, right? And we are when we are drawing this type of uh, line, you need to draw this line at 45 angle, 45 degree angle. So electron will go from 1s, right? We have in neutral aluminum, we have 13. okay so in a neutral aluminium atom the first two electron will go this 1s 1s2 then we have to go here we have to go here and start here so 2s 2 then we have 2p 6 after 2p we have 3s right so 3s we need 2 after 3s we need to write the 3p 3p will write 1 look 6 8 10 12 13 so this is the electron configuration of neutral uh, neutral aluminum right to write the electron configuration of this three, you need to remove electron from the highest value of n plus l here and here. So this is the electron configuration of aluminum three plus. So you can take skin sheet screenshot from this uh, for this uh, table.